CSS is what's going to allow us to style and design our web pages. So CSS stands for Cascading Style Sheets. And what that means is they're documents that allow us to style and change the layout and look and feel of our web page, and they're cascading. So, for example, if we were to style this unordered list here, that, would ca that style would cascade down to these list items. And if we put anything else inside of here, that style would cascade to those as well. So let's try it out with an example. Um, let's say that we change the color here to green. So how we can easily do that is add a style tag, a style attribute to the UL tag. So we're going to say style equals color colon green. And now you can see over here, uh, it's made all of our list items green because it cascaded down to all of those. Uh, WebStorm, you'll notice, has this really convenient color picker. So we can choose green, yellow, dark green, or all these different values. And we can also, um, if we click somewhere else, click on this little box, and we get a really nice color picker with the different RGB values. I'll be going over those, sh those soon. Now let's, uh, let's create another element inside the list item to make sure that that cascades even further. So this time I'm going to use the strong tag. And the strong tag just means, hey, this content inside the strong tags is important. So I'm going to say fun. So you're going to create fun games. And you can see that fun it becomes bold. So by default, the strong tag makes things bold. But it's also green because it cascaded down from the unordered list. But we can actually alter that further and override it. So we can say for the strong tag, we're going to make the style color blue. And you can see it overrode the cascaded style. Now I want you to change some colors of some various elements in your web page, in your portfolio page. 